I'm in Seattle now. The flight was quite turbulent. I've never been in Seattle before. I want to live in Seattle one day. Just because I hear so much great things about it. And now, a transit flight to Portland. I made it. We're in Portland. It's like surprisingly nice. Like I'm a little chilly, but I only have two layers on. Okay, Portland, I see you. My brother bought food. That's my brother, and this is Hank. Hello. <laughs> so Hank really had to pee. That's why. Sorry, buddy. Come on. You still peeing? So I'm walking him. He's pooping. Oh my god, he just made a fresh steaming poop so I need to pick it up so Hank and I are on a walk today we filmed a makeup video for this I'm trying to get a photo of Hank when I back up to take photos of him he comes right up so this is the only angle I can get of him we ran a lot right Hank and now I'm just gonna see where he wants to go and then we'll go you wanna go this way oh Hank tell them we also took really nice photos of you right I mean, have a great day. <laughs> I went to Wells Fargo. It's literally right across the street from where my brother lives, which is fantastic because in Chicago, it's a two hour trip to get to the nearest Wells Fargo's bank. Now I'm going to Safeway to get some like fruits and vegetables because I want to eat some fruits and vegetables and he literally has nothing. I'm going home now with milk and groceries in this bag because we need to love the environment. I'm pretty sure that this Safeway is the first one that I came to when I was in Portland like almost two years ago. It was International Women's Day yesterday and just a reminder to myself and viewers that are watching to practice inclusive feminism. That means intersectional feminism. You can't exclude trans women. It can't only be like white feminism or like able body feminism. Feminism means quality regardless of gender and that has to be inclusive of race and all types of body ability. A couple months ago I started watching Portlandia and it's so funny. It's a nice place. There's no tax. I bought all of my groceries and I was like 20 something. It was recently eating disorder awareness week. I think it was from like February 26 to March 4 or something. So technically I missed it, but I want to talk about it. As I said before in my mukbang videos and maybe it slips out in different makeup videos. Um, I have one eating disorder for sure. Binge eating disorder. I exercise compulsively when I really hate my body so maybe there's like body dysmorphia there I'm not sure I've never ever been happy with my body even at my fittest when I could jump the highest when I could run a mile in like six or five minutes I deal with my feelings emotions and stressful events in life by binge eating it's not healthy I know that I am putting a stress on my digestive system the way um, I'm eating. I'm going to share something that I have never shared with anyone before. Apart from one of my best friends, Amanda, nobody knows this. In my high school years, one of the year, I bought these diet pills. They quote unquote allowed you to eat without gaining weight. So you would take them before or after you eat a meal. I'm not sure. And you can get them over the counter at Myanmar. And when you poop, 
Like there would be like oil floating around in the toilet bowl. I think I went through at least three packs of the pills and then eventually I stopped because it made me feel so guilty. But I just wanted to share my experience with this. I just want other people to know that it happens. Like people deal with um, eating disorders and stuff. If you are dealing with any eating disorders at all, this is just me taking my time out to talk about my experience with it. I'm still dealing with it. If you want to talk to someone about an eating disorder or something, you can always talk to me. I always reply to comments or you can DM me on Instagram. It's always open. My hair looks so green. I had a really good day today. Hank is being so sad. Just give me a call. Baby, talk about us. Let's talk about us, baby. All I know. Just give me a call. For Annika, I don't know where she is. I haven't seen her in like three years. Where is my friend? I don't see my friend. This reminds me of like a date or like a catfish show. Oh! <laughs> oh, my god. oh! Oh my god! I haven't seen it. Like the 2000s? <laughs> what is this? 